this is Stumpy, and welcome to a Minecraft Let's Play video, and another video inside of Stumpy's Wonderful World! Today in this video I'm going to be placing some animals down on Animal Island, which I started building in the, the last episode, and I did pretty rubbish in the last episode. Normally I'm doing rubbish because um, I'm getting killed or defeated by big bosses I'm trying to defeat, the last episode I did rubbish just because I was a bit slow. I was just a bit slow and bad at building. To be fair, I wasn't prepared for just how dangerous building a little island for my animals would be. I thought it would be fine, I thought it would be safe, but uh, yeah, because it's on a, a sky island, uh, there's a whole load of um, of harpies and wyverns and uh, other nasties. Or pretty much just harpies and wyverns, to be honest. Uh, yeah, that were attacking me, so uh, I'm going to have to be a little bit more careful this time. Uh, but yeah. I'm basically going to go and carry on. Oh, I wanted bunnies. No, no, no. Stay away from the pit. No, stay away from the pit. Oh, <laughs> I was scared it was going to go into the pit. Let's see if I can go and grab the uh, the other bunny down here as well, if you don't mind. There we go. That is exactly what I what I wanted because I built a um a bunny hutch in the uh, the last episode, uh, which was called Bunny Hutch. <laughs> and um, uh, yeah, there's one bunny which I put on the inside, uh, but I also wanted uh, to put one on the uh, the outside as well. So I've got a, another bunny now. I can do that. We're gonna have a little quick check down here uh, just to see if there's uh, any uh, any penguins inside of this biome box and nope uh, sadly there isn't but there is a an okay chance uh, that we might have some up by the uh, the sky island I put some snow up there and I actually extended the uh, the snow out uh, even further so it goes all the way down to here and uh, sadly uh, no penguins now uh, but hopefully we've got increased chances and what's what's this bunny doing with this like watch its ears it keeps like look, they're up straight now and it keeps just putting them. Whoa! All right, forget the ears. Forget the ears. Let's uh, <laughs> let's deal with this then first. Yeah, this is the uh, the problem with uh, uh with building up here. It is um going to to be day quite soon, as uh, so the things will hopefully get a bit safer here. And uh, using these um. Uh, these Nimbus clouds uh, is amazing for, for doing damage. You can see just as it's going there underneath me, it's just getting absolutely destroyed. And oh, that was my last healing potion. Oh no, I do have some uh, some more here actually. Uh, so let's go and uh, if I do this. Oh no, these are just normal healing potions. I didn't take the right healing potions. That's bad, but at least I have some healing potions. And uh, uh, using the clouds, uh, hopefully I'll be uh, okay. So, all right, I think the first thing I want to do is I'm going to go and I'm going to put the... Um, uh, put the uh, the bunny uh, in the uh, in the hutch. So uh, I do have some more of my uh, terrariums here. Uh, so I got four of these uh, in here, and I got five of me as well, actually. Uh, so yeah, I think I don't need a workbench. Nope. I can just go and plop the uh, the bunny in, and uh, now I'm gonna see whether it's gonna actually let me place it down here somewhere. Can I place it here? I think there's a, a mushroom in the way. I think it's gonna be like in front of the uh, the fence, but it should look okay anyway. Is it not gonna let me place it down? There we go. Ha <laughs> ha! Perfect. I have two bunnies. And look, did you see the ear thing? Every now and then they just squeeze their ears out and it looks a little bit weird. But let's go and put the uh, uh, the uh, the Nimbus cloud there, which should be protecting me. And uh, let's get to work. And oh, look! One of the trees has started to grow as well. That is beautiful. Hopefully uh, that tree's going to keep growing taller. Oh no, it's got... It's got the uh, the top on. Does that mean it's going to stop growing? I wanted these to grow really, really tall, so I could put lots of um uh, lots of birds on them. Uh, but this one's not very tall. Hopefully, it's going to to keep growing, or the other ones will be taller. <laughs> uh, but yeah, rather waiting around for that, I am going to go and build a uh, a burrow. Uh, this is going to be a, a burrow uh, for the uh, for the squirrels. So I'm going to go down here. I'm going to grab all of this uh, gold as well uh, because I like gold. And if I kind of loop around down here, maybe uh, this is where I can go and put uh, all of the the squirrels. And how about that? That was the, the quickest thing to build, wasn't it? <laughs> just dig myself a little bit of a, a hole. I'm just going to go and uh, neaten it up a little bit. Well, I don't want it to be too neat, actually, uh, because I want it to look like uh, this place was borrowed out uh, by the uh, the squirrels. So let's kind of uh, mess it up uh, a little bit like this. Uh, but the uh, the ground needs to be flat, uh, so the, uh, the squirrels uh, will actually fit in. So let me just kind of dig away a few bits like this, just to uh, make it look a little bit messy, like uh, some squirrels' claws have been making this uh, burrow. And uh, yeah, I think all I need to do is go and place them in so uh, I've actually got them in the uh, the chest over here uh, so let me go and uh, grab these and I can go and place the uh, the squirrels uh, down in the the burrow I don't know what else they would have in the the burrow oh acorns <laughs> I can put some acorns in there maybe I could put this chest in there once I'm finished with it and uh, put some acorns in and seeing as I have a uh, quite a few terrariums and they're very easy to make I might as well go and do a few of them and oh did you see that did you see the penguin one for a second there that's the one I really want look at that I want to know how it's going to fit in, to be honest. Maybe it's going to be a huge one. Uh, but what I can do, uh, before I um, 
uh, actually get my penguin. Hopefully uh, I do get one soon. Uh, yeah, as I can build the uh, the igloo uh, ready for it. So I'm going to build the igloo quite big, uh, just because I have no idea how big the uh, the penguins are going to be. And even if they are quite small, like in the uh, the terrarium, uh, that means I can just have more than one. So let's see uh, how many squirrels can I fit down here. There's one, there's two, and there's three all in a row. I might uh, spread them uh, them out a little bit. Uh, let me do this one as close to here as I can do. And then let me place this one maybe uh, about here. Will this be about in the middle there maybe? Oh, nope. That went right up against the, the edge again. Uh, let's try and do it about... Nope, too close to this side. Uh, if I move it slightly across, maybe place it about uh, here. Is this going to be in the middle? There we go. Uh, this is uh, just about perfect. I'm going to put some torches in. And look, they love it. <laughs> look how happy they are. Look, they love their little burrow. So this is my uh, little burrow for all of the, uh, uh, for all of the, uh, the little squirrels. <laughs> this is good. I'm starting uh, to, to like um, uh, this island already. And I guess once I get more animals, I can put more in. I don't know if these are all of the, the animals I can get. Or, um, or whether these are just the only ones I've seen. Hmm, I'm not entirely sure. Uh, but sadly, uh, I can't actually get any fish. Uh, but hopefully they're... Either... Oh, there's a worm. There's a little worm down here. Can I get the worm? Oh, I got a worm. Did you see that? I got myself a worm. Okay, I don't know. Yes, now I can put the the worm in. <gasps> I can have a worm cage. Yes, 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 yes. Let's, let's see this. Let's see this. I gotta see this. Let's just place it down here for now. Let's see my worm. Oh, look at it. <laughs> Does it mean? Oh, look, it wiggles as well. I'm just gonna protect it with these clouds and also protect me as well. Right. It looks like we have a we have another home to make. We have um we have a worm. Right. Let's keep this away from the bird, shall we? Let's go and gather this up. I can get creepy crawlies then, I guess. This is cool. Uh, yeah, apparently, according to according to you lot, <laughs> according to some of you, uh, I got some comments saying that uh, you can't do fishing rods uh, in uh, in the Xbox version. So uh, I don't know what worms can do then. Maybe they're just here to, to look cute. Because I thought they were going to be bait. But let's go and uh, dig down here a little bit then. Here, so let's go and uh, fill in all of this dirt. Uh, so I'm not going to be able to get back down there. But of course, we can see it anyway. Uh, just as if uh, the worm just wiggled its way down to the bottom there. That's so cu uh, cute. I wonder what other creepy crawlies and stuff I can get then. Right, I really need to, to keep an eye out for them as much as I can then. Oh, this is good as well. Look, I can fill in like uh, this as well. And it looks like only something tiny like a worm I could have uh, wiggled its way down there. I'm just going to leave uh, a few torches as well. Uh, just so... um. Oh uh, yeah, just so it's uh, lit up nicely. So uh, I need to, to do this. And then if I go like... Uh, I'll, I'll go right to the, the edge here and then I can go and uh, add some of the uh, the snow back down because uh, I want as much snow as possible uh, just to in, uh, increase my chances uh, of getting the um, of getting the, the penguin. So I fill the underground there back in with dirt and uh, now I can go and uh, put back down the uh, the snow and I think the next thing to do then uh, is to build the uh, the actual igloo. So uh, sadly, still no penguins here. I just don't know if they're going to spawn while I'm here. Maybe because I've been quite close to the, uh, the snow biome here for a while and uh, maybe there's chance one has has spawned in there. You can tell how much I want this penguin, can't you? Any penguins in here for me, please? Nope. It's so sad every time I come here and I can't see anything. Oh, but it's okay. Uh, we can get the other uh, penguins home uh, ready anyway. And uh, we can also... Uh, do a bit of preparation uh, for the uh, the birds as well, uh, because even though the tree hasn't grown, because I've placed the acorn down, I know exactly uh, where they are going to grow. So I could kind of do some branches coming up from here or somewhere, and I know that eventually the uh, the tree is going to grow. Uh, so that is where the uh, the birds are going to 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 be. And can't you make bird baths as well? Am I imagining that, or can you make bird baths? I think you might be able to. Let me go and uh, put down the other uh, workbench here, and uh, let me see if you can make bird baths. I think you just might need stone, but I'm pretty sure you uh, uh you can, because that would be a uh, quite a cool thing. Maybe I could get rid of uh, one of the the trees, maybe the one in the the middle, and put a bird bath there instead. It should hopefully uh, be enough. Can you make them? I'm sure I've seen them. I can make a bath. Oh, what was that? Oh, there's a, a dynasty bathtub. Oh, very fancy. I can make some bowls, a bunch of beds. Or maybe I'm ima imagining it then. Am I imagining it? I'm sh No, I'm sure I've seen it. I am sure I have seen a bird bath in this game. I'm going to have one more look through, and if I can't find it, I'll give up. But I'm sure at some point I've seen a bird bath. So there's workbenches. These are all the doors. Uh, these are platforms, boulder, uh, inlet pump, toilet, 
uh, trash can. I'm sure it'll be around here. Oh, there's a fish bowl. Oh, there we go. That's the way I could have the, the fish. I could just have a, a normal fish bowl like that. I could do that, actually. That could be quite cool. And I'm getting attacked here. Okay, maybe I'm imagining it then. Maybe you can't make bird baths or uh, maybe you just got to find them. Uh, maybe that. Maybe I'm thinking of the statues that look like bird baths or something. I'm not sure. But anyway, uh, let's get to, to work then. Let's try and uh, build uh, an igloo. So I've got some I got some snow bricks, which I found. I've also got a bunny. <laughs> and I got some normal snow. And I also got some ice as well. So I might make um some more of this uh this snow into the the snow bricks uh hopefully i can do it with just uh, a workbench yep uh, all i need is a, a workbench i guess uh, using a, a furnace wouldn't really work with snow you're just gonna <laughs> end up with a whole load of water so i think i build most of it out of these uh these snow bricks i think will be the uh, the best thing to do and let's go and just put a, another cloud right above me just to uh, hopefully keep uh, uh, all of these um harpies off my off my back and uh, yeah let's go and uh, try and build it i'll start it uh, about here and, um, I guess I kind of just need to do this. Actually, I might make it a little bit steeper. If I go, like, two up and then one across and then two up like this. And let me go and break away these other blocks just so it'll make it be easier to be symmetrical. Uh, kind of like this. Uh, that way it'll be definitely high enough for them. Like that. Is this kind of igloo shaped? And if I go up two more now, uh, I can now go and start going uh, across here like this. Actually, I don't know if that's too steep. Actually, I think I think my my first design uh, might have been a, a little bit better. I want to get this right. I want this to, to look like a, a good igloo. And then once I've done kind of the, the rough shape uh, with these snow bricks, I can go and add in the uh, the normal snow and ice and stuff and I uh, kind of just decorate it. So let's kind of just go. I think this is, uh, is just going to, to have to do. So let's just uh, keep building along in my slow way of just jumping and placing them. <laughs> uh, build along as much as we can. And uh, now let's uh, go and uh, uh, staircase back down to the, the other side. So this is the, uh, the rough shape. What I might be able to do is maybe play around with uh, the hammer a bit and slope it a bit more. But then again, they don't really look sloped, do they? They all are kind of blocky, you know. They're made out of big snow bricks, aren't they? So I think this is actually probably uh, just about as good as it can be. But I do uh, want it to be an igloo that I can walk into. So I guess on one of the sides, I do it on this side, I am uh, going to, to make uh, an actual doorway uh, that I can fit in. So I do this to here, and then uh, I can actually add... Can you make snow doors? I'm not sure. You can normally make uh, a bunch of weird items out of weird things. So uh, maybe I could make a snow door. And look at all the, <laughs> the harpies underneath me. Um, let's go and uh, have a look. So I can't see one. Nope. It looks like we can't actually uh, make snow doors. Let's just make uh, a normal wooden door for now. Uh, that's, this will uh, look just uh, about fine. So let's go and uh, grab this. And uh, we can go and uh, place this uh, down here like this. And uh, now let's uh, let's do the uh, the background. I think that's one of the, the things that's making it weird is uh, not being able to see any uh, snow in the, the background. So now uh, we need to, to make ourselves uh, some snow walls, which should be around here. Uh, they're not very bright and colourful, uh, but it should look quite cool anyway. So I got uh, uh, quite a lot of them. Uh, hopefully this is going to be enough to, to fill in the uh, the entire background. And then the only thing we're really missing after that is the actual penguins. We've got a lovely home for them, uh, but no actual penguins. And where? Oh, here it is. I couldn't even see it because it isn't very white. I didn't even see it there. But here we go. Here are all of my snow brick walls. Uh, so let's go and try and fill this in. Uh, hopefully the uh, the igloo's not going to melt down because I filled it full of torches. <laughs> uh, but we should be uh, okay. And uh, I'm not sure, though, uh, whether this is going to, to be enough. I don't want to have any gaps. And uh, oh, it might be... It might be close. It looks like it's almost filled in, but you can see all of these little black bits here. Uh, these are all of the, the gaps. It's going to be a close one. i got nine pieces left. Is this going to be enough? Oh, it might be. Are there any more gaps? I think I've just about done it. And there are a... um. A few bits that are kind of uh, going over the the edge here. If I use the the hammer, I should be able to get rid of uh, rid of them. Uh, there's another bit up here, and oh no, I'm just doing the thing where I'm changing the wall. This is really annoying. I don't like this. It's really handy, but I kind of wish there was a a different tool uh, that kind of reshaped these bits. Because uh, yeah, it looks uh. I don't know, it's just a little bit annoying when you're trying to get rid of the, the background and then you end up doing all of this malarkey. But <laughs> it ended up uh, okay in the end and we can shut the door and uh, then that way I can see which bits are, are overhanging here and I can get rid of them. And uh, now I've got like just a few bits left. So normally if you just kind of go uh, crazy and just be placing them everywhere, uh, normally eventually it's going to fill in somewhere uh, just in case you left a gap maybe in the ground down here. There we go. I was able to go and uh, fill it all in. So let's go now and uh, try and organize these torches a little bit better. Uh, I'll place one up here and then one up here as well. And uh, we'll get rid of all of these torches on the floor. And uh, I don't want to jinx it. 
And I've actually been quite lucky. The googlies kind of went a bit crazy at me yesterday, but it's not been so bad here. I know it's not been uh, night time yet, which has uh, helped out, uh, but it's not been too bad. Uh, but I do have all of this ice and stuff, so I might go and uh, I might go and try and decorate a little bit. Maybe if I do some ice along the uh, the top here. Actually, I might do that on the uh, the hole inside. If I go and get rid of these torches for now and do it around the uh, the whole edge on the the inside, I think this might actually look quite cool. If I do uh, do it like this, does that look quite nice? I think that looks quite good. It kind of links up with the uh, the snow quite nicely. So I might go and uh, add uh, add that in there. And I might also add a few like little uh, like snow hills like on the uh, the outside uh, just to make it not look uh, so just completely flat uh, like it is right now. So let's go and put uh, my torches back down here. And uh, now I'm just going to go and get the uh, not the the snow bricks uh, but just the uh, the normal snow. And uh, actually, there's not really much ground left because you see the uh, the whole bit that's uh, going off the uh, the edge. Uh, yeah, this is obviously not going to to be here uh, once I have the the penguins. The reason all that's there is just uh, to hopefully I uh, get a, a better chance of having a more uh, penguins spawning in, but uh, sadly we've not been too lucky yet. I don't know if there's uh, anything I'm missing. Uh, maybe if you want to point out uh, anything uh, to help me get them more regularly, uh, that would be very helpful. Because I have seen them, I have had them around my house, uh, but just not all that much. So uh, what I can do now is uh, first put up some of these Nimbus rods, just to uh, hopefully trim out some of these googlies. And uh, I'm going to grab some dirt as well. Oh no, oh no, 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 I'm falling. I am falling. Can you see me? <laughs> I just saw it on the, the back of the, the screen there. I was kind of endlessly falling. Um, oh, well, let's go and head back up. And while we're down here, I might as well uh, go and have uh, another check uh, on the uh, the uh, the snow biome here, uh, just to see if the uh, the penguins here. I am not going to rest until I have got my penguin. And is there anything in? Oh, there's an ice slime. Uh, can I catch the ice slime? I don't think so. No, you can't really capture any of the the googlies. But that proves uh, that I do get uh, things that should be spawning in a in a snow biome. Uh, I do get them in my world. So that's um that's kind of at least a little bit promising. Uh, but what I can work on now is I'm going to go and uh, uh, finish off the uh, the um the squirrel burrow a little bit. I think I made it a little bit too thick here. I might go and uh, just fill this in a, a little bit uh, like this, just to make it look more like uh, it was a, a small rodent that dug it rather than big old me. <laughs> and uh, now I can start doing a little bit of work uh, on the... Um uh, on the uh, the bird place. And, oh, it looks like I've got a harpy stuck in the, the burrow as well. So I know this tree is going to keep growing up here. Well, actually, let's just do an add a branch, just assuming the tree is going to be this size, uh, just in case it doesn't grow anymore. So if I kind of go up to about here, and then if I... Oh, oh no, no, I'm throwing birds away. Did you see that? Did you see all the birds? They were flying. Were they my birds? They were, every time I went to place the block, birds were flying out of the tree. Is that a thing? Is that a thing I didn't know about? Look, watch this. Let's see if it does it again. Oh, look at this. Birds! Birds everywhere! <laughs> why, is it, why is this happening? Is this a thing that happens? Look at this. It's just an endless row of birds going. Can I just capture? Oh, look at them. They're all flying around. They're all flying around together. Look, they're all doing like a perfect flight. Look at this. <gasps> I've got like a bird show. That is so cool. And I could just, I think I could just capture them all as well. Yeah, I can just go and capture them all up and get a million of them. Oh, look, and they do stack as well. Let's go and just capture them all up. <laughs> and then I can just set them out whenever I want. That is so cool. Maybe that's how I got the worm. Let me try and, um, let me place dirt on the ground. Let me try and place the wood on the ground. Maybe it was something similar. Do I need to, like, shake the ground or something? Because like, they keep coming out of there. Maybe, maybe I did something to make the worm come out of the, the ground. And maybe I could get a, a whole load of things coming out the ground. I wonder what if I tried it on a different tree. Okay, let me go downstairs uh, quickly. I know I'm getting a little bit distracted, but I need to do a little bit of investigating here. Because that was kind of ridiculous. Just to get <laughs> that amount of birds just flying out of a tree. Let's go down to a jungle tree. And let's try the same thing. And uh, see if a, a different type of bird comes out. So... Um, let me try Do I need to do it holding the wood? Oh, no, no, I just get the same types of birds. <laughs> I can just go up and down like this and just get all the, uh, the cardinals just coming out of the, uh, the tree. Why do, why does this happen? And look at them all just flying around. This is, this is so weird. I wonder what other things I can make come out of other objects. I wonder if I can, you know, if you click on, like, a certain item with, like, um... I don't know, with dirt or something, maybe you get rabbits or squirrels or something coming out. Uh, let me just try clicking on just a normal piece of, uh, of wood rather than, uh, than a tree and see if a bird comes out. No, it has to be a tree. Maybe it's the item you click on the, the tree will determine what you get. 
Hmm. I really want to see if I can get some more worms or some other beasties like that. Look, there's another bird down here. That's just a normal one. Uh, I wonder what you do. if I use a pickaxe, that's just going to break it. Maybe if I break the, the leaves, are more things going to come out? Oh, yeah, look. Look, look, look. I got another worm. I got another worm down here. Ah, destroying the uh, the leaves. That seems well. Let's go and destroy some more leaves down here. The things I want to just... Oh, whoopsie. <laughs> I want to destroy the leaves, but... I'm trying. I don't want to destroy the the beasties. Let's go and see if there's a uh, some more leaves here. Like, I'm talking like about like, the uh, the tall grass and things. Here. Let's go and uh, break some more of these and uh, see if uh, uh, we get any more worms and things. This is cool though. I can add to uh, my worm collection. My worm collection has doubled. Rather than one worm, I now have two worms. I'm not getting uh, much luck uh, getting uh, any more uh, right now though. Let's go and. Um uh, let's see if we can break some more here, if I can find some more. Uh, sadly, I seem to just be uh, finding googlies, though. Hmm. Okay, I'm definitely going to have to do some more investigating. Oh, there we go. Another little worm. <laughs> I don't seem to be finding any uh, other insects, uh, but I've got uh, three worms now that I can go and uh, add down. So, right. What I think I'm going to do then is uh, in the next episode, uh, I can go and add in the, the worms. Uh, hopefully the uh, the trees would have grown a bit more, so I can add in the uh, the birds as well. And oh, was there a bird bath statue? I'm sure I'm sure at some point I've seen a bird bath in this game, but I might be going mad. I don't know. Maybe I'm just going mad. <laughs> uh, yes, I'm going to um I'm going to do that. I'm going to uh, add in the the birds. I'm going to put the uh, the worms in and uh, then hopefully get a penguin. Fingers crossed. I'm going <laughs> to keep holding out hope for that. And also, uh, I can make some fish bowls and I can maybe go and start adding in some some fish as well. Even though I can't catch them and put them in aquariums, I could still uh, at least put them in, in fish bowls. And so then, uh, hopefully, uh, Animal Island uh, will be uh, complete. Uh, so sadly, that is the, uh, the end of this episode here. I will be leaving a link in the, uh, the description uh, to the next episode once it's online. But before I go, there's one thing that I just really, really want to do. And that is this. Woohoo! <laughs> Birds are released inside of my house! <laughs> oh, look at them going crazy. I love the way they all fly in, like, formation. And look, they all, like, bounce off the, the same blocks. Look at that! It's like a figure of eight plus another figure of eight and maybe one more. Look, are they just going to go and keep doing this? I got like a bird show. That is so cool. That is so unbelievable. And I could just get an endless supply of these. And then, because they keep just going in the exact same route, if I want to gather them up, I can just stand here like this and just keep grabbing them as they come past. <laughs> Fantastic. Anyway, that is the end of this episode here. I want to thank you all very much for watching. And I will see you all later. Bye.